Hello everybody, welcome back here. We're here with another unboxing. This time we have Konami's own... Wait, wh wh which way is this? Oh yeah, I, it is. Oh, it is both. Wow. Konami's own Yu-Gi-Oh! Shonen Jump trading card game legendary deck. Um, Again, saw this at Target. I see a lot of these or... I I see this a lot at Target, um, which is kind of weird because they have it there, but like I don't see a lot of movement compared to, say, Lorcana, Magic of the Gathering, or uh, Pokemon. So uh, let's, let's dive in here. I'm not really familiar with uh, kind of Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, I barely watched the anime. What the hell was that? Um, so let's see here. We'll open this up. Jesus. There we go. Let's see what we got here on the back. I really like the case, but it's like kind of like a little bit gaudy what they got compared to what uh, other people, you know, Magic Gathering and uh, Pokemon have. So what 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 is in here? God, I cannot read these lettering. I I just can't. Oh, Yugi's, um, Kaiba, Joey. Okay. Okay. So I guess this is. With saying in, possibly it could be in here. This is like the slowest box I've ever seen. There we go. Really nice box, though. Jesus. Dark burning attack. Cool. This little promo card. Oh, there's a couple, th couple things in here. Let's see here. Cool. Really nice art. Cool. Wow, this is this is this is a lot. There's there's not much in here. There is just not much in here. Wow, wow. Um, I that is that is wild. That is wild for kind of like three promo cards, and then I assume these are decks. God, those are sharp cards. We got um, Suffol Sky Dragon, the Blackstone of Legend. In Maiden of the Eyes. I wonder if these are like commander decks or battle decks. You know, commander decks for uh, Magic Gathering. God, that is... It is a really nice box, but man, that is just a lot of empty space. That's a lot of packaging for uh, very little things. So let's, uh, let's see what's in these. These are like really sharp decks. Get the factory tape off this thing. Yep, yep. No, oh, there we go. That's a that's. Here we go. There we go. It's like a three hundred dollar card in here. It is wild that this is Konami. Konami people that made uh, Castlevania and um, Pez, the Pez dispenser. Oh yeah, that. Oh god, these are. Wow, this is weird. Okay, these are weird cards. A little bit sharper though. Like they're just straight up cut. Let's see here. There's a lot of them though. Made of eyes. I, I cannot read this lettering. I literally can't. Jesus. I... I have to, like, shine it. We got Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. So we got that going for us. That is... That is super hard. So I have two lights right here. Um, and it's just, like... <laughs> it is impossible to read unless I put it off to the side. And, like, bring it up to the light of one light. I wonder... I wonder what happens if I do this. Is it easier to read? Oh yeah. Okay. Oh my god, I got a blue eyes white dragon. Oh my god. Okay, so these are foil like, so we'll put these right here. Oh my god. I got another blue eyes white dragon. And another. And a dragon spirit of the white. 
White Stone of Legend. God, these cards feel really weird. Like, they feel like... I don't know. I need to do a... They feel... They feel kind of cheap. I wonder what the return... Like... Okay, they're, they're not any foil stuff in here anymore, so we'll turn on the... There we go. Battle Ox. I like how the art hasn't really changed either. It kind of looks like that 90s, like, art, late 90s art. Like, Magic the Gathering kind of, like, stuff, too. Blade Knight. Trigger Dragon. Tiger Dragon. Ancient Lamp. God, there's a lot here. It is weird, you know, trying to... What the hell? Enemy controller. It's a, it's a Genesis controller? <laughs> oh my god, this is a Dreamcast controller. This would have to be like a Dreamcast controller. Like a, It's a Sega one because you have the three buttons. And then it's bottom down, so you, it's Dreamcast. Remember, remember the Dreamcast? All all four games that came out in that game that people care? Dude, this is wild. So they like <laughs> This is how cheap these are. Like I, I again I'm not meaning to like dog on people that like Yu-Gi-Oh! I think this is interesting, but the way they set it up with this like massive box, and then you you get cards with the smallest font on here. They don't, like, scale it. They're like, okay, um, uh, we, we have to use the the seven-point font. And then we, um, you know, that, that nothing changes. Nothing changes. Jesus. This is so, it's, yeah, and here's one that has less. God dang. Like, like how are you supposed to read these? Discard one level eight monster, draw two. Man. Wild. Just so much text. Negate attack. These are in some sort of order, yeah. These are trap cards. Trap cards. Any sort of rarity kind of things I'm looking for? Not really. Jars of... Oh, Azur! Oh my god. And for the rare, the Fist of the White Dragon. Oh shit, we got a token card. We got, um... Th this guy. This kind of cool, though. Yeah, we'll put these off to the side. I wonder... I wonder how Konami's doing about this. I heard that that, that game that they released... Uh, is 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 fine, like the um, that de deck building game, like the the the, the like the the Magic Arena Pokemon Live kind of. Jesus, this is this is not fun. Okay, God, it, it feels like a deck of playing cards, like a cheap playing cards. God, look at all that font. Look at all that. Look at that text. Oh, <gasps> the legend Dexter. Okay, okay. There, that's the one from the anime. We'll put that off to the side. That's a thirty dollar card. Ties beneath. Oh, this one. I think this one goes to this. Oh, <gasps> the forbidden one. <gasps> no. This is hilarious. That is hilarious. Oh, man. This is hilarious. Wow. Look, Mom. I, I got, I got Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I got the meme. I wonder... Hmm. We'll put that off to the side. I'm going to hard case those. I'm going to... Like, just like 90s era art. Dark ma Magician Girl. They are a little bit thicker, 
I think. But it's just like the sharp edges is really weird. Kind of the the like kind of the whiteness of these cards just look really weird from the side profile, you know. Oh, we have Lego here. Jesus, it's just man. I, I assume this is like a complete deck. You don't need. Well, I probably should put that off to the side. It's not like a booster pack or anything. It really doesn't say anything. Legendary deck. It just says legend. Yeah, I guess it's, it does say legendary deck too. And the last foil is uh, the tokens are. Yu-Gi-Oh! There we go. Cool. So you can check me out at my local uh, Maui... Uh... <laughs> Jesus. It's weird. So weird. It's just... It's like a... Oh, man. Again, I, I don't mean to dog on anybody that enjoys, you know, I, I kind of dog a lot on, um, Jesus, look at these markings on here. I did not do that. This is a grade two. It does smell nice, though. Return of the... Jesus, there is just so much going on in this art. Let me turn off the left camera again. Left light again. Man. There is just so much going on. Oh, shit. This is a different card. Um. Huh. We'll put that off to the side. We'll get that in my app. dragon like it, it's i find it fascinating that they don't really update the art it's from 2002 hmm. like the art style like very kind of like magic the gathering kind of like art style very old what the fuck you see that A little kind of weird time wizard God, a lot of this is this is a lot so the $30 box too a lot of cards for 30 bucks I, I still can't believe the text. Like, look at this. We got... Send one monster from the deck to the grave. And then, look at this. This four paragraph. Uh, when an opponent monster declares an attack, roll six-sided dice and apply uh, the result. Have uh, your LP make your attack a direct attack. Like, I have this thing zo like so close to this camera. And I barely see it. Man. Was it Yu-Gi-Oh that uh that they like when there was a tournament some guy brought in a huge um huge deck of uh cards to say hey there needs to be a limit on this stuff and then the final cards are Joey Cool what, Let's see what this says right now Get this over here Okay I use collector um, search. No, it's not for Magic the Gathering. Red Eye. Eyes. Is this it? Is this a... 
three and a half dollar card? No, that's not it. Uh, flare. Is this a 60? <laughs> now, these are first editions. Okay. This is a really old card, so this is what I got there. It looks like this. Oh, here it is. Here it is. It's a 70. Yeah, there it is. Legendary deck. Let's see. Let's look at like a generic deck. It is an unlimited. So it is a uh, 56 cent card. Let's see what the value on some of this stuff. No way. No way. Where is that blue eyes white dragon? Holy shit, dude. No way that's, that's like five bucks. We're doing extra content. Price high to low. What's the biggest in the set? Dude, what the hell? <laughs> that is wild. I, I guess I gotta sleeve some of these. The, the highest valued one is the Blue Eyes White Dragon, which should be uh, down here, yeah? Yeah. It, this, is, this is it, yeah? Them. What? Let's see. Oh, it's probably like the hollow version, too. Oh, I have the unlimited version, and the unlimited version still... Still three, no, three dollars for this card. Man, that's hilarious. That is truly hilarious. Well, now I have some... What about... Are any of these worth anything? This is, this is tr truly wild. Is there any in it number indicator? It is a common. That that is wild that they call it a common. Nope, no indicator. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.